we have high expectations. Uh, we expect them to be ready to go to college at the end of their four years here, and we're not going to accept anything less than that. One of the unique things about our program as well is that we give them a lot of experience in the entire Adobe suite. So they learn how to use Photoshop, they learn how to use Illustrator, they build websites. So those are skills that they can take with them as they go on. And I recall one of our students when we had some other guests here say, PowerPoint presentations, what are, we don't do those, we're, we're beyond that. Our kids do Prezi, so then I had to talk to them about what's a Prezi. I mean, a Prezi is uh, a PowerPoint on steroids, but it, I mean, it, it just, the advancements in technology that our students are going to have when they leave here is just amazing. What makes Facing History New Tech uh, unique? We are just trying to get our kids to become civic, civically responsible. Uh, we started them on day one doing that. Uh, you know, Facing History has a journey that the kids go through, and the first journey is to uh, decide who you are. That's one thing that our students have. They have a sense of pride here. They are pioneering students. There's none like them in the country. They are going to become the leaders in this. This school teaches you how to be professional. If I had to look at him three years ago and look at him now, no parent could be prouder. You know, you hear 24-7 learning, it truly is 24-7 learning now because anywhere a student has a computer, they can access their classes, access their projects, their parents can check and see what they're doing. It's something that the kids live with every single day. Um, so the kids are well aware of technology, it's a part of who they are, it's part of their identity, it's part of their lives. While technology isn't the focus, um, it is what enables the learning to happen very seamlessly. Here you are provided a computer in every single class. Everything you do is on the computer. When students come in, they're put in a professional learning environment. They get to work together, which is more like what they would experience in the real world. No one works by themselves in the real world these days. The most common question I got was, when am I ever going to use this? Now it's actually real for them. Everything they do, they're actually seeing why they're using it, where they're using it, how they're using it. The New Tech High Schools came about um, in Napa Valley. The business leaders came to the school district there and stated that the school district was not preparing students that they needed. New Tech embraces the entire student. They don't um, just address content or just address discipline. Instead, we are preparing our students for the world outside of the classroom. Since the school teaches you that, like once you go out to work, you already have those skills and those qualities that they're looking for. It's just a different way of teaching. You're getting them involved, you're getting the kids to really drive the project, to drive the learning, and so it's not teacher-driven, it's really student-driven. The technology is just a great vehicle to deliver the instruction. You don't have to be a computer whiz once you get here. Everything you need, we will teach you. You know, the people here, they try so hard to get to know you so well. While at other schools, you may have to reach out more to your teachers to get the help and assistance that you need. I like everything about it. The difference is in the model that we have here, and it's also the collegiality and collaboration. Our teachers are on board. Um, I use them as leaders. They're the ones that promote. And all of our teachers say this is the hardest they ever worked, but it's given them the most. I love New Tech. I love the teachers here. I love everybody here, honestly, because it is very family oriented. All of our classrooms are kind of fishbowls, so you can walk by anytime and see what we're in there doing. I think the parents really appreciate that openness. Most parents, I think, recognize that we need rigorous instruction to prepare these students for working or for college or for the military. Wherever they go when they leave us, They've got to be ready, and our job is to get them ready. We have the ability to you know, provide an environment that is safe, small, where the teachers and the students can build that relationship. And once you, you know, start to develop that relationship, the learning just, just skyrockets from there. It's not easy. It's challenging, but it's a fun challenge. 
Our students are excited about coming. They want to come to school. They want to be here. They want to see what they're, they're going to be doing that day. They want to see the new and things that they're going to learn in that class. So I think that's important. You see these kids grow in ways that you do not necessarily see a traditional student grow. Between the technology, the collaboration, cooperation, work ethic, professionalism, our kids are years ahead of students that may not have had that exposure. I hope that the parents are choosing to send their students here because they know that we're dedicated teachers and uh, we believe in this program and we believe that the kids are going to flourish here. The difference is the kids come out ready to communicate with other adults in a professional manner. Our students have an opportunity that other people in the country, they wish they had opportunities like this. And our concept here, we want to make sure that we're presenting students and getting students ready for the 21st century workforce. New Tech is the place to be. You're not alone in school. It's a good school. You always have somebody that will help you out if you need help. This is my home.